Hello everybody and welcome back to season 2 of the crew mode. We're continuing with Schalke, just ignore that IX episode, the, the save corrupted after one video, and we're going to be continuing into season 2. So we've made some new signings, we've got some new tactics, we've got some new players coming through the youth academy. It's going to be an exciting episode, so hopefully you're ready to see what the future holds for Schalke. Now if you didn't watch the last season, you're probably wondering where we finished, why we're still in the Bundesliga with Schalke. Well we got a mid-table finish, we had people like Julian Draxler. Here you can see one of the new signings by the way, Ivan Rakitic, former Schalke player. Not not too many people know that. But we had Draxler, we had Ozil, Klozniac. Yeah, go back and watch that last season because we've got some good goals, some good play and honestly it's a pretty fun watch. Anyway, let's get on with preseason. You'll see it in the background. I'm just going to comment over these because I didn't record the live commentary at the time. So you just expect there to be a couple of good goals. Some interesting new players, see if we can spot all three who made it into the preseason. And yeah, we'll get into the season very, very shortly. Now, preseason, we did the European tournament. I can't remember which one it is. It was mainly in Holland, so we're playing here at the Amsterdam Arena where Rakitic just scored an absolute roadie on his debut against Burnley. Uh, I think we ended up winning the preseason tournament. Not too important. We'll just skip over that and show some of the best goals in the background while we talk about what we're trying to do this season. Now, of course, with every team, you want to try and play in European football, and that's exactly what we're targeting with Schalke. We need to finish in the top six to get European football. Last year, I think we finished 11th, so it's not too much of a challenge, especially with some of our better players that we've recently signed into the club. Uh, Pre-season, yeah, it's going well. We just beat Schalke. You can see the fans are loving it too. Mexican wave going around the Amsterdam Arena in the second game against Lyon, which unfortunately, I think we ended up drawing, which nearly knocked us out of the tournament. But thankfully, results went our own way in other matches, so we continue on in the game. Now, preseason, you know, not the most interesting thing, but don't worry, we'll be getting to the Bundesliga in about one or two minutes. We'll be showing you the new signings in one or two minutes, and just introducing the season very, very shortly. We're just going to use this period to try and catch up with what happened last year while showing off preseason this year, and you might spot the new striker up front in this preseason game, so keep an eye out for him. Now, where did we do last year? Well, Drexler was playing behind someone like Mark Uth, who was, you know, pretty good striker, but we've replaced him now with Musa Marega. That's right, 90 strength, 90 pace, 80 finishing, six foot one or two. He's just a better version of Philip Mateta, who we already had. So, yeah, he's really fun to use. I can tell you, I've already played four or five matches, so very, very fun player to use. Very effective against people, especially against Bayern Munich's two centre-backs, who they have Bonucci and PK. Um, you can imagine someone of his size, physicality, strength, speed, you know, just super useful against players like that. And yeah, we're going to absolutely try and use them. You can see him there winning a header against centre-back. Beast in the air as well. Really, really like this guy. If you have any other suggestions for players, I've actually signed two or three players from that community post. Um, I think I saw Josh Fangerman and someone called Hack, um, Robin Hack I think it is. So yeah, any suggestions in the comments below, do let me know and you can see us score the winning penalty here. Well done Schalke. First silverware in the first episode of season two. Good stuff. You can see Huntler there wishing he was on the pitch in the colours, but let's have a look at our transfers so far. You can see there, Theo Hernandez gone to Spurs, pretty good signing in real life, be very well used on FIFA, but we've got Robin Hack, Josh Fangerman, Sergi Romero from Man U on a free, Musa Mariga from Porto on a free, Ivan Rakitic, of course, used to play for Schalke, we swapped Harrit for him, because I didn't really like him that much, and we've let three players go, so we're going to need to balance the book by letting a big name go, but anyway, let's get into my live commentary from the Stuttgart against Schalke match. Right, I'm very excited for this first game of the season, of course. Uh, a lot of pressure on us this year to try and do better than we did last year. I think Stuttgart did pretty well against us last year as well. So, um, yeah, try not to do a big defeat on opening day. Going forward, we've got Mariga at front, Ozil, Draxler, Rakitic. You know, we've got a lot of small technical passing players. Uh, so, yeah, fingers crossed it's going to be good. We're going to have good possession this year. We're going to try and keep on the ball, keep the pressure up there. And we've always got the option of getting that out to a fast player on the wing, like Hack or Matondo, trying to cross it in. Anyway, doesn't it like Stuttgart have their stadium on the game, the Mercedes-Benz Arena in Stuttgart? Unlucky for them, of course, Schalke Stadium is in the game. There he is, Sergi Romero, new goalkeeper, new man between sticks. Karsdorp, my best signing last year, to be honest. 
right back boss the whole way down the pitch. And it's kick off now in the first match of the season. So let's try and get it off to a good start, good high press to start off with. Try and get the ball, get into their faces. Try and get Rakitic, Ozil, Draxler on the ball and see if we can score some nice long shots. Right, nice flick from the there. Can we get it? Yes, nice. Okay, get it out the wing. Come on, McKenny. He's pretty fast, but I think we want Mateta through the middle here. Uh, we have to go back to Draxler. Come on, Draxler. Yes, Rakitic. Come on, shoot. Oh, off the post. What a goal. That would have been so sick. Right, Serdar's got it in the middle. Come on, play through to Mariga. Mariga's got the pace against Barco. Come on, hit. Oh, yes. That's why we signed him. Come on, celebrate. Oh, the nice zigzag boy. Can't get near this man. Get him. Serdar's got it now in midfield. Come on, turn around. Uh, okay, lost it. Come on, get back at it. Oh, no. That's too weak from Serdar. Come on, let's close him down. Karlsburg. Come on. No. Right. Oh, no. No. Oh, I ran away. I ran the wrong way. I ran the wrong way and it's an easy finish. We've got it out wide now. Let's try and keep them out wide. Force them to cross it in because we've got Sani in the field. I mean, defence on I mean. Come on, Sani, get to it. No, no. Oh, oh, no. Really good save there from Romero. Unfortunately, nothing you can do. Oh, big tackle from Karsdok. Keep the pressure on, lads. Come on, get into them. Okay, Rakitic can't press. Oh, no, we've left the big gap. Endo. Oh, come on, no. Oh, it's just come straight through his legs. That's so weak from the defender. I think it was Nastasic. Right, Ozil gets it out wide. Come on, through to Sardar. We've got Mariga and we've got Draxler. Who are we going to go to? Obviously, Mariga. All right, I'm just going to try and cut inside and brown this guy and curl it in the corner. Come on, cut inside, curl it. Yes, exactly like I planned it. Get in. Right, get it out wide. Come on, Matondo. Oh, no, we need to get the pace on the wings to Matondo. Oh, I can see this being a goal. Come on, get back. No, no. Oh, I've passed it the wrong way. What a stupid goal. Well, at least the Stuttgart fans are liking it. Right, corner. Can we stop this from going in? Head it away. Yes, good header. Oh, Moyes is keen. How have they got him? Oh, Chalov at the back post, isn't it? Oh, oh, he's missed it into the ground. Right, get into them more. More high press, team press. Come on. Oh, no, that guy's open in the middle. Sane, block it off. No, Karsdorp, you've gone to sleep. Oh, it's awful again. Yeah, so that's basically all the match was. We lost 5-2. Honestly, four of the goals at least were just mistakes on my part. Should have definitely done better. But yeah, we got some more transfer offers in. Schubert, you know, decent goalkeeper for his age. Just be accepted on loan here quickly. Cut it off here. Ospika, nah, we're not really interested in selling him. He's the back left back. Sane and Uth, we're just trying to negotiate big deals for. I don't really want to sell them, but if we got a lot of money... I know we could definitely replace both with better players, especially 29 and 30 years old. So we'll just try and get something like 20 million for them. See what happens. We do need to make a bit of money back, although I'm very doubtful that they will accept those deals. Okay, let's get into our next match, which is going to be against Augsburg. Another decent team. I think they finished below us last year. You can see our team on the left there. Mariga, Draxler, Rakitic, Ozil. McKenny and Serdar, and we're going to be getting back into the live commentary. See you all after the game. Finally, back at home, Schalke Stadium. I love it, although the shadows are a bit annoying. <laughs> right, come on, let's just play it out from the back. Sani, Nastasic, Serdar, who have we got here? Rakitic, get to Draxler on the wing. Right, is anyone in the middle? Draxler? No. Oh, Rakitic is in space. I'm hitting it. Come on. Oh, that's terrible. Right, Belfolder, I think he's making his debut. Sane has just been muscled off the ball by him, which is his only good attribute. Vargas on the wing. Oh, don't get it in that gap. Oh, Douglas the Wiz, what a save. And then an overhead kick. Nah. Right, Rakitic bossing it from deep now. McKenny next to him, doing all the running for both of them. Klasniak, he's decent at the overlap, to be honest. He's got more pace than Framberger, probably. Mariga's in the middle. Can he head it? Heads it. Oh, wide. Right, get into him more. Belfolder is decent. He's a bit stronger than my players as well. He's held off Serda there. Vargas against Karsdor. Belfolder again. Good tackle from Sane. Smolov has just gone around the Stasic. And that's terrible. Right, Maria, come on. Cut inside. Get a ball in or something. Come on, cross it. Ah, no. Corner though. We've got some big men. We've got like Sane and Maria in there. Sane. Oh, good shot. Right around his defender. Right, Mariga, get on it. Oh, good defence from him. Mariga's just fallen over. What's he doing? 
Right, and Stasic coming out. Oh, he's been beaten. Don't drag Sani towards him. Come on. Oh, no, he's just kept going. Oh, I've been done there. That is terrible. Right, long kick out. Mariga's not got it. I can't win a header with this guy. He's huge, but I just can't win a header. I'm not very good with the target, man. Maybe it's time for Oop to come back in. Oh, I've been ball rolled. Oh, behind. And, yeah, that's it. I can't believe we've lost another game against Augsburg. Well, they're not even a good team. At least they are decent. And you imagine Bayern Munich are going to be a good challenge. But, no, another loss. What an awful start. Right, back into the menus. And you can see, time for Bayern Munich. So we're going to make a couple of changes in this one just to try and change things up. We're obviously off to a losing streak. So we're going to try Rudy, who's just returned from loan in midfield in place of McKenney. Drexler in the middle now. And we're going to play Robin Hack on the wing for a bit more pace. Karstorp still going to play. Kolasinac, we haven't really got any choice. And Mariga pretty much has to start as well, unless we play someone like Benito Rahman. But anyway, let's get into live commentary. I only just got a glimpse of the Bayern Munich team there. That is terrifying. They had PK, Benucci, Immobile, Deli Ali. I think they had Brozovic in midfield or Kovacic, one of the two. Tough. Right, come on. Straight away pressure on them. Benucci's not going to be too fast and we've been absolutely torn apart. Come on, get over to him. Get over to Mustasic. Good cover, good cover. Get into him. Oh, that's good defending from Mustasic there. No, he's covered Mariga deep. Okay, let's do a bit of tick attacker here. Try and break through the lines. Drax the Mariga. Rudy, what's he doing up there? Mariga, has he got Benucci for strength and pace? Yes. Gets a shot off. Easy, really, isn't it? Right, let's cut off the short option like every single person does. That's a good pass. Straight to Deli Ali. Goretzka. Brozovic. That's a good midfield for FIFA. Immobile. Uh, Brozovic. Lewandowski like shot there. Annoying. Right. We've got it out wide again. We can't just keep getting torn apart like we are doing. Otherwise, it's going to be cricket stall. You know, 10 0 maybe. Right, Deli Ali, get over to him, Stasic. Okay, he's got it out wide. Coleman, what a cross. Oh, in the deal. You can't miss that. Right. Nearly the second half. We're going to have to make a sub. I think we're going to bring on um, Tondo up front, possibly. A bit more pace against PK. Let's try and hold them off for a little bit longer. Oh, good defending from Serdar there. That tackle was perfect. Right, Mariga's coming off, Matondo's coming on. See if we can outrun PK and Bonucci with him. Never know with FIFA. We're gonna give it a go. Come on, lads. You can do this. Right, runs it down the get it down the line. Hack to Rudy. Rudy, come on. Back to hack. Yeah, he's got loads of space in behind Sergi Roberto. Get it. Right, Matondo's there, come on. Got a score. Oh, that's terrible. Shoot. Oh, so it didn't fall for me. Right, trying to block it off there, but didn't quite get it. Come on, Serdar, I'll press high. Good press. Come on, through to Matondo. No look, 180 pass, but Matondo has the pace. They've brought on Kimmich to play right back, but it doesn't matter because Matondo's just scored a goal. Okay, Drax there. Come on, see Matondo's run. He's gone in behind. What a run, what a pass. Two, two. Yes, Matondo. The difference this guy makes over Moriga. Jesus Christ. No wonder he's celebrating in front of the fans. Right. Good header from Mustasic Serdar. Mateta playing on the wing. Serdar, turn around, get it behind you to Draxler or Rudy. If it's Rudy, hit it. Come on, just shoot. Shoot. Ah, oh, unlucky Rudy. Couldn't quite get the angle. Right, a couple of minutes to hold on. Immobile is the strength me there. Come on, don't play it in that massive gap. No, no, no. Oh, you knew it was gonna happen. I'll let you all enjoy the PS5 celebration, even though I don't want to see it. It's Immobile celebrating in front of the Allianz after he's just sunk Schalke's dreams. That's such a Neuer thing to do as well. Running around with your arms, pretending you did it. God damn it, Neuer. Ugh. Right, no time for this. We'll just hoof it. Okay, wow. Game over. And, yeah. Can't believe it. We've lost three in a row. That's not a good start to any series or any season. No wonder Matondo's looking so annoyed. He pretty much dominated. But anyway, that's all we have time for in today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you are happy that the series has come back. And I hope you'll stick around for more episodes by pressing subscribe. See you all next time. Thank you all for watching and goodbye.